Hey everyone, so today I have a very special video because this is a very rare set of dolls. So these just came out this year in 2016 and it's the Beauty and the Beast Platinum set. It features a 17 inch Belle and Beast doll in their formal outfits. So Belle in her yellow dress, Beast in his blue outfit. And so let's take a look at it. So this doll set is limited to 500 worldwide, so it's pretty rare. The box is gorgeous. It's kind of a struggle because the dolls are behind these doors. And so you want to display the dolls, obviously. But the box is really pretty, too. Let's give it a little turnaround. Here's the side. It has all this rose detailing. It's got gold, which looks really beautiful with the red. The back has the stained glass window art of the castle. And then there's some text here, but I will read that off while I'm showing you some up close looks at the dolls. So you're not just staring at the back of the box in the meantime. And then here's a look at the top. And I'm not sure what the bottom looks like. It's just solid yellowy gold color. Oh, this is very heavy. <laughs> All right, now let's open it up. Da, da, da. Da, da, da. You can see it has the rose pattern on the inside too, and these actually fold all the way back. So you can fold them behind the box, just like that. I'm actually gonna take off this front piece first because it does come off. And then there is the plastic. Okay, and I think I'm gonna take this out a little further and pull this out as well. There we go. Oh, certificate of authenticity. Oh, there's two, is there one for each doll? So yeah, there's one certificate for each doll. So this one says Bell, 131 of 500, and then Beast, 131 of 500. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna read off the back of the box and give you some nice close-ups of the dolls. The Disney Store is proud to present the worldwide limited edition Bell and Beast doll set. Revel in the timeless story of heroism, villainy, and enchanted romance from the iconic animated film Beauty and the Beast. With carefully crafted details, the resplendent romance between Bell and Beast is stunningly captured. Beginning with Belle's iconic ball gown, a gleaming metallic gold print, and sparkling gems embellish her gathered organza overskirt, while tiered ruching captivates. A gem-encrusted floral brooch decorates her bodice, and Lux gold gloves provide a fanciful finishing touch. Beast's ensemble features a royal navy blue jacket ornamented with exquisite metallic trim. His satin cravat and white lace cuffs enhance his ballroom attire, while Beast's printed gold satin vest enchants. Belle and Beast walk arm in arm, bringing to life the enchanting romance between these two iconic characters. Beautifully designed by Disney Store artists, this limited edition doll set is a must-have for collectors and fans alike. Okay, now time for my opinion on the dolls. I don't even know where to begin with this. This is just a stunning set. It is gorgeous. I love the way Belle's hair is styled. It just sits so nicely. And then her bodice is gorgeous. This detailing up here, plus right here, and just her face sculpt in general, I really like, especially her mouth. It's just really cute. I don't know how to describe it. Her entire face and just her gentle expression, just, oh, she's beautiful. One criticism a lot of people had on Facebook, I follow this limited edition doll group, a lot of people criticized this ribbon, and I agree it's kind of strange. It's like they kind of just stuck a ribbon on there, but I think it's still really pretty. I think it just feels odd because the ends are just exposed. They're not tucked in like this or anything and then stitch down it's kind of just a piece of ribbon but i still think it's a nice touch and i really really like all the ruching in here so i think that helps because this is so busy you just want something that's a little bit less busy on top of it i don't know that's just my two cents it's not my favorite thing but at the same time it doesn't bother me then underneath she has this golden layer and then she has her 
oh, what is that called? The crinoline or whatever. The meshy bits and then some lace at the very bottom. I know you can't really see that. The camera's not really set up for that, but it's mostly covered anyway. And yeah, she is so gorgeous. Oh, I didn't even notice her earrings. She has a little yellow gemstone in her ear. Very pretty. One thing I don't like about gloved dolls is that they are mittens instead of fingered gloves. So that's a bit weird. <laughs> but there's really no way to make the gloves go on the fingers. I guess you could do maybe a bit of stitching to make it look like it does go on the fingers. I don't know. I'm sure they've tried a few options and mittens work the best, I guess. Now for Beast, same criticism I have of most male dolls is that they usually just have plastic sculpts instead of having actual hair. Although I don't know how hard that would have been to style something like that. Maybe it would have looked really bad, really messy. I don't know. So maybe the plastic was for the best. <laughs> I love his jacket. The embroidery is gorgeous. It's not just one shade of gold. There's sort of a yellow gold and a more whiter gold within it. It looks so great, especially with the trim along the jacket. Mm, that looks good. Lace peeking out. And there's even a really gorgeous pattern on his vest. And then the embroidery. He's got little buttons. Then there's this bit right here. Oh, oh yes. I love the velvety fabric that his jacket is made of. And then he does have his actual floofy tail. <laughs> See, this is made of hair, but it's kind of messy. That You'd really have to style it, but I guess they do that with other characters too. Like her hair is crusty yet styled, so I feel like there might have been a way for them to do Beast in actual hair, but you know, maybe that would have made the doll even more expensive. I don't know. Maybe it's just too much work for these dolls. But yeah, I got striped down his pants. Oh, I love this so much. I love how much her dress poofs. It's just massive. Oh, oh, yes, yes, yes. A million times. Yes, I love this set. Anyway, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this nice up-close look at the Platinum set. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Anyway, <laughs> if you want to see more limited edition dolls, be sure to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.